Hey guys, Justin James with the 10-7 here, and I'm here to talk about why Kamaru Usman needs to be the replacement for Bilal and UFC 310. Guys, Kamara Usman versus Shavkat would be a huge event for the UFC. We look at one end. We look at Shavkat, 18-0 with 18 finishes. That's 6-0 in the UFC. This guy can show he can strike. This guy can show he can grapple. This guy can show he can wrestle. This is, it's time for him to take a huge step up in competition and fighting the former UFC champ would be doing just that. We look at Kamara Usman winning the belt against Tyrone Woodley in 2019. From 2019 to 2021, Kamara had five title defenses. And unfortunately, going for his sixth title defense against Leanne Edwards, he was winning the fight going into the fifth round and gets brutally head kicked uh, by Leon to go in. Since that, he's lost two fights in a row. He had a rematch with Leon Edwards. He loses the decision. Then he steps up short notice to fight Cosmot and loses again to decision. I really think this is the right replacement fight to make because, again, Usman has earned his stripes in the UFC. This would be a huge step up for Shavkat as well. All right. Now, another great point to think about is the passing of the torch. If Usman comes in here and gets decimated by Shavkat, this is a great time for Usman to pass the torch to Shavkat when he's going to go fight for the championship against Bilal if he beats Usman. Now, on the other hand, if Usman comes in there and beats Shavkat, you know, it's, it's a great time to throw him back into title contention too as well after everything he's already done for the UFC throughout the years. Again, Usman had five title defenses in two years. Guys, this day and age, that's just unheard of. He's earned his stripes. He deserves that spot. He says he's ready. Throw Usman in there against Shavkat. Guys, tell me what you think in the comments.